Okay, I've done a modification of this one. It was like two fans going to blow, both blowing in the bottom, so sort of like to give more power. But now I've split them up, so you have one fan here that blows in the bottom round here. And that's to keep the part cool, and this other fan to keep the hot end pin pins cool on the E3D version six. So that is pretty closed off so that the air will go up here and like out to there. I'll show you the bottom. Well, actually, I'll uh, do this so we can look at the bottom a bit easier. So here's the bottom, and the on this side, the air blows in. Right there, that's all enclosed, so it'll be forced down here. These are to diffuse the air a bit, so that's it, some of it must almost come along here and round, round. So all the hot end that comes through the center hole here should be surrounded by cool air, and that should cool the part. Now, I'm, I've tried to make this model as small as I can so that it'll, it'll fit onto my uh, carriage. Just get that back on the bed. Let's do that. Okay. Sometimes it can be a bit of a nuisance to get rid of the ruler. But there you are. Now I haven't tried it, printing this or anything with this at all. I don't know how well it would fit. It's just a basic concept, so it'll probably need a bit of tweaking, I imagine. So as you see, the air can blow down that side, as I said, and along these tubes and round to cool the part. And with this fan, two 40 millimeter fans it takes, this fan it sort of blows up there and keeps the hot end cool. These clip on the hot end. Hopefully this here, this sort of dent is for the E3D version 6 cables, the cartridge, heated cartridge and thermos couple. Okay, that's a bit of a look around that. As I say, I have not tried this. I have not printed it out or anything. I'll give you a quick look at it in color. You see all those settings over there. This is on a different computer to what I normally use to print out. So we've got this side here. I sort of will blow air up here onto the E3D version 6 fins that these will clip onto. Nozzle comes down through the central part. Now we have another fan, both 40 millimeter fans on each side, two separate ones blow air into this sort of cavern here, down. These are some sort of baffles to diffuse some of the breeze a bit and then it will blow along here, round here, likewise on that side. This like, nozzle here, this sorry, this cut out this dent here is for the E3D version 6 cables. That's about it really, I think. Now this has not been printed, so probably needs modifying and all sorts.